centimeters, once uh, less than one square meter, uh, completely dark, tiny bunker, four people inside standing for all night long, if there was still light in the morning, they were sent to work, and next night they were standing again, never less than three nights, if someone went to toilet without permission of luckily the three nights of standing, five nights for talking at work, ten nights for lazy labor, this was almost impossible to survive this ten nights of standing when you have to work every day so hard.
just locally and they use building materials to build the brick barracks which you can see over there so this barracks made of brick were built first later it was cheaper and faster to build wooden barracks so like on the right so finally majority of these barracks in Virtana were made of wood first to, uh, to, uh, first purpose was sent to Anakin Police and Virtana camp and then next year six new camps on the right come for new arrivals, come for Jews from the Tatarat and start there was camp for Hungarian Jewish women there was camp for men on the right there was camp for Roma and I've told you about the railway junction in a town uh, before the war so the very first trains were sent uh, um, up to were sent to the cottages by by trucks. So finally, to speed up this process to make it faster, prisoners were forced to build new railway line from the old platform up to the select tombstones like the graves uh, through ages in various religions, memorial plaques which you can see that are in 23 different languages spoken by victims, the language of majority Yiddish, you can find in the middle, there is Hungarian, there is Polish, Judo, Spanish. From the, the, the furnaces which were inside burning all bigger pieces of human bones, they had to crush these bones on powder and uh, ashes were then collected into pits, which you can see in front of you. At every crematorium, when such a pits were full, the ashes were removed, were transferred by trucks, were dumped into rivers. The ashes were also spread on fields and used as fertilizer. Because uh, there are still human ashes in such a place, there's never such a place in which these ashes were found. You can see these four black stones. Uh, the inscriptions in Polish, in English, Hebrew and Yiddish, uh, which was the language of majority of the victims. So in such a way, all these places in which human ashes were found are marked on the territory of Berkenau. You can see a few such a places marked in such a way. In the first camp, there were men, first, then women, that is temporary structures, but I can't believe it, it's okay. 